This is Don DiBartolo, a senior commodities broker and market strategist with Daniels Trading in Chicago. I'm also the trader behind the Trade Spotlight Advisory Service. Trade Spotlight's broken up into three segments futures, commodity options, and spreads. Uh, this is Beyond the Spotlight, a video that will spotlight two or three markets that may become trading opportunities for this week. This week begins with Monday, January 25th, 2021. Please pause the video and read the disclosures to understand the risks involved with futures and commodity options trading. Jumping right into our first chart, this is the March 2021 Canadian dollar. Okay, this chart has been on my radar for weeks. It's shown up on the Beyond the Spotlight a couple times. I'm waiting patiently for a close below this lower trend line. Uh, going back to this pivot point low, uh, which was 74.60 on the 29th of October. See, the market has been climbing higher, but these lows are falling on this lower trend line, just strengthening this lower trend line. The market is below a 20-day moving average, and that 20-day moving average looks to be rolling over as well. We're very close to that lower trend line. A close below there sets up a short entry opportunity. If our, indic in, if our indicators are in line, and my MACD trend indicator is showing that the market is turning over to a potential downtrend, and my stochastics indicator, this is a momentum indicator, is showing that there is downside momentum in this market. Stop loss would potentially go above this 12-month contract high that was made last week. And that price is 79.44 from the 21st of January. Potential downside target comes in around 74.50 near this support level. Uh, there may be some support at this level, this pivot point low is 77 20 and a half from the 21st of December um, so stop losses will be trailed if we can get down into this level for sure uh, to lock in some profit on the trade all right this is the March 2021 Canadian dollar the second and last chart I want to take a look at for today is the May 2021 Chicago wheat I was looking for an opportunity to sell this contract last week on a break of this lower trend line that did occur during Friday's session, uh, but that was a, a big sell-off in the market well below that lower trend line. That lower trend line was coming in about uh, 650, uh, 655 or so, and you can see the market closed at 636 even on that session. So I'd be looking for a pullback to sell this contract perhaps halfway of this range or near this 20 day moving average. Sunday night and Monday mornings activity is already on this chart. I wanted you to show I wanted to show you that there the pullback is starting. So if this pullback continues and these indicators line back up, I'm going to look for an opportunity to sell the wheat contract. Right now, the trend is down, uh, which is fine. That's where we want it to be. But the momentum is kind of leveled off. So I'd like to see maybe a couple more days uh, get into this area here or maybe even back to the trend line, have the momentum hook back over and short the contract. Uh, stop losses would go above this now potential resistant level. That high size is just above 660 here. So the closer we can get to this 20-day moving average or this lower trend line, the, risk, the less risk there is on this, uh, on this trade. Downside target would be all the way down here around the 570 level near this, uh, near this support level. You can see the 20-day uh, moving average starting to level off a little bit. Same for the 50-day uh, moving average. So this one may materialize later this week but definitely keep it on the radar it's the may 2021 chicago wheat okay this is what the uh, trade spotlight email service looks like uh, it goes directly into your inbox 
We'll have a timestamp when the trade recommendation is sent out, a write-up, the precise entry and exit orders, so you know the risk-reward parameters initially for each trade, any important information like margin requirements or option expiration dates, and a chart that you can enlarge. If you're not following the Trade Spotlight, I encourage you to do so. I do offer a free 90-day free trial. Otherwise, it's free to clients of mine or the firm. Just go to danielstrading.com, click on Advisories, and then under Technical Analysis, you'll find Trade Spotlight. You can see recent posts, and you can subscribe. If you have any questions about the two charts I discussed today, or just the markets in general, feel free to reach out. Uh, local, sell, toll-free, and email address. Trade Spotlight is in positions currently. We're short the orange juice contract. We're long the British pound contract. We have on a bull call spread in coffee and a put in sugar. So there's a lot going on. So uh, make sure you get on the list. Uh, make sure you ask questions uh, and follow along. Thank you for taking the time to listen, and happy trading.